18 years Been Rainbow Six in for 18 years Eagles watch as I throw rogue spears From covert ops to the missions in career A lone wolf pulls out the black dawn As a raven shield meets Athena's sword With an iron wrath ride like a black arrow On lockdown in a critical hour See my game come of age as I take it to Vegas And make it rain in for ages And when the rain hits rays of light From hazy skylines rainbows shine bright And when the rain hits rays of light From hazy skylines It's a daily crisis for today's fighters In the age of ISIS Death is a fate with which he dices One wrong roll and he may lay lifeless huh. Too little, too late Realising time dedicated to training's priceless Pain and sweat's why better when it's getting better That don't tell us why there are calluses on my fist We've got to work as a team, a unit yeah. To deduce your scheme and ruin it Swiftly we move in through these midnight trees Whose leaves are moonlit From the window to the wall yeah. Everything you've ever come to know in love is gonna fall From a Mac-10 to an Enfield Anything could trigger things real men feel Anything can trigger things real men feel Anything can trigger things real men feel And, and when the rain hits rays of light From hazy skylines Rainbows shine bright And when the rain hits rays of light From hazy skylines Rainbows shine bright hey, I wear these shades in a halo yeah. Take aim somewhere over the rainbow Six of the best in the chest is a payload Hey bro, yeah. you better lay low yeah. When I'm breezing, spinning, I'm a killer tornado yeah. Waiting to blow like a pain volcano I swear in the name of NATO yeah. I'll put an X on your brain like a baked potato We came with the cave with the cave And your capers are game, bro yeah. In the face of the danger, the same vagueless But I'm raising the ante and raising the glass In the name of Francis and, and when the rain hits rays of light From hazy skylines Rainbows shine bright And when the rain Alright, so let's get it on. I need to find another place that we can adequately reinforce. Oh god, the reinforcement between the bombs is not good. Really not good. Then again, on this spot is pretty much the only place I can understand why someone would do that. I got the shock drone. That means I got it. All right, they're smoking that part. And they destroyed his smoke grenade, I think. Looks like smoke is prepping to go outside and sh that didn't work out well for him. Nice, the Lord got a kill. Well, I'm not gonna jump out because I think that would be a waste of time and probably a bad idea. Lord got another kill. Crap, we lost the Lord. Here's the thing, we need to... We need to make sure they don't do a plant here. Ah, crap, me and Ella. One on the mat! I wonder which mat. Yeah, he... He got him. Well done, Ella. Just need to survive a bit longer here. Tango down. I didn't even see the guy. And if I... It doesn't seem like Jackal actually saw me either, because Jackal 
seem to be very surprised that I appeared right the fuck out of nowhere. Uh, let's see here. I think we can go for might for this one, actually. At least we contributed. That is going to be what I take away from... Right now. All right, so we got... I can take it. No, never mind. It was a bit too late for that. Just drop it when we spawn and I'll take the diffuser. We need to locate a bomb. All we have to do now is find them and they're not where we were. Not really a strange choice since what the place we chose is not the most easily defended one. And I think that might actually be throwing off the enemy from their game. Because usually you pick the spot we're heading to. Drone has located a bomb. Yeah. Cavera. I really like the fact that we ha actually have a very confident Tachanka player on Five the team. I really like that. <sighs> Got it. Located a bomb. Make your way to its location and defuse it. The diffuser is no longer in your possession. All right, so Fuse is most likely going to try and fuse the enemy. I know, very surprising. But I'm going to let these guys uh, go first and clear a path. And, yeah. Should be clear. Go for the other window. Come on, Fuse, don't just stand there. Go for the other window. I'm not actually saying that. I think they just broke a window here. Reload. Ash is injured. I could have sworn they, uh, they bro broke a window here. Apparently they did not. Let's put down a claymore there and keep an eye out here. Let's keep covering the six. You also need to be very, very... Ah, crap. I'm just gonna follow these guys in and... Now, if Jackal can just move a, move a bit, uh, I might be able to. Come on, we can do this. Time to ring some ears. Yeah, fuck, he got it. Bandit is down. He's down. Op four eliminated. I didn't even plan on that. I thought Bandit was the only guy. And then I almost put a shot in poor Fuse. So far, so good. All we need to do now is keep it up. I think we're gonna... No, we're gonna go Rook this time, actually. Put that heavy armor on, and I know we already have an anchor in terms of Tchanka, but having another anchor in terms of Rook, considering there's two bombs and everything, it won't hurt. So, Doom will be theirs, or at least that's the general plan. I'm fairly certain I've jinxed it now. <sighs> I know this is ranked and everything, but it has been kind of relaxing so far. And that's a kind of interesting thing to note. Well, Secure the bombs. pretty much doing everything is relaxing at the moment. Uh, armor's down at bomb B. 
pretty much everything is relaxing right now because we are having a snowstorm here in Sweden. Shocker, I know, a snowstorm in Sweden. Who would have thought? And everything is cold and miserable outside. And I could have bet there was a hatch up here. Really, I could have bet there was... Oh, wait, there's one here. I got the B hatch. And... Question is if I should try and anchor... Yeah, I, I should anchor. Anchor below, basically. Ah, crap. I'm gonna reinforce here to give snow smoke. Not smoke, smoke is somewhere else. Some someone entirely different. I don't know if they went by the window or if they did or not. Window. Oh, come on! That first burst should have been enough to take out Fuse. Come on, Lord, you can do this. All friendlies were eliminated. Mission failure. It was a nice try. But I don't think he had any chance. <sighs> the problem we had there was that we had sufficient anchors in one of the areas, but not in the other one. Uh, in layman's terms, that's basically, we should have had more people on the other spot. And we didn't. So that's basically all there is to it. Remember what I said about jinxing everything? I was gonna pick up the diffuser again, but... Nope. So, we better... To locate a bomb. Why are they ack... Seriously, I mean, if you have a new player on your team in Rainbow Six Siege, tell him what he's doing wrong, and do so in a nice way. I mean, there are a lot of people in Siege who are very happy to tell you what you're doing wrong in their own twisted way. But the art of constructive criticism was one of the things that Rainbow Six Siege community was once very good at. And I really l would like it to be that case again. And that's why I can't stand when this guy goes, Oh, we have a level 20 noob on our team. Okay. You've been a level 20 noob once, too. And what happened? Yeah, people played ranked. People learned. So it's not, it's not really weird. Let's see if we can't drone scout the enemy. Uh, never mind. I was uh, completely wrong about where. I think that was actually Buck being. Nope, that's Ella B. Oh, don't go, don't go into the fucking. I'm gonna be interrogated. Ah, uh, never mind. Here's the thing. 
we got two guys down outside. So why on earth were they rushing out in order to shoot Ella? It's not like they were actually gonna get her. I mean, they were not going to, because Ella was too far away. And despite that, they decided that, hey, we are gonna try to... Two are in the bathroom, Ella is in bomb room A. Operator standing. I wonder what Ash is doing, but I don't want to leave this drone. Okay, so Ash is gonna go for an attack from above. I can... Ah, uh, crap. 15 seconds. We have been eliminated. So, things have gone less well that round. I must admit, it was kind of nice by Bandit by actually being able to run after. But we need to actually do something about <laughs> this right now. It is interesting to note that Caviero was not going for an interrogation with me. And I wonder why. I mean, I can take into account that she most likely did not know that I was unguarded. But still, the entire decision to just break off the assault to go after Ella, who was basically just, uh, who was basically just flanking somebody else, it wasn't a good decision. Deploying barbed wire. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna stick with that because. If you make that kind of a decision, then you are pretty much saying that now we're not going to continue the assault. But the assault was proceeding well with mutually co supporting operators. But never mind. Let's just get... Oh, uh, I don't have any impact grenades. <laughs> and... Let's finish up the reinforcements here. And reinforce their. Uh, most likely just reinforce them. I'm gonna hang around here, near Bombay. They are. I hear repelling on my side. I mean, they won once by doing a very quick grab for the bomb. So I wouldn't be surprised if they tried it again. Uh, I have no idea what why Lesion and Castle and Echo is so fucking far away, but giving them a shot at him. Be advised, Op 4 has located a bomb. Changing me! Okay, sledge so zombie. Let's see if we can't. I didn't actually intend to hit anyone on that score. My intention was merely to scare them off. Window here is open, just so you know. Ah, crap. They are coming that direction. And they know I'm here. Here they come. At least one of them is on my side. Yeah, compromised. I 
I can hear the guy. Sledge is down. He carried the defuser. Ah, oh, crap. I'm the last guy. I'm a bit... I'm a bit terrified, you guys. Ah, crap! Mission failed. All friendlies have been neutralized. I should have just stayed there and try and count the diffuser. That was my bad. Uh, let's see here. Someone else picked Fermite. I could go for Ying or I could go for Fuse. I could go for Glass or Sledge. I actually don't really know what the fuck to pick right now. I'm going Twitch. I have a sense I'm dealing with a pre-made here because uh, these guys have decided to just go for a recruit rush. Ah, fuck this. We need to locate a bomb. I'm not going to be, be terribly to sad if I lose this because I still have rank to go before the abyss. Your drone has found a bomb. Let's see. Die, Ella, die! Hopefully, the damage we have done will be enough. I mean, we didn't cause it that much damage, but hey. Five seconds before insertion. I mean, this is my revenge. The game is turning against us because I was stupid enough to say that I was being calm and thought this was relaxing and fuck that. The game just decided, no, let's give, get you back into that nice ladder anxiety you know so well. Right, so let's throw out the drone and... Oh, I'm so fucking stupid. Why on earth did I decide to do that? I was like, did my sound card glitch or something like that? Because I was like, why is there so much fucking fire going on? Oh, they're going shotgun recruit. Oh. That C4 must have been annoying. <laughs> I got an injury assist. Oh god. I've been taking too much damage here. Okay. What the fuck is going on here? They're coming from behind. I got shot by Lysium. And I didn't take co as good cover as I thought I did. Uh, but hey, Fermite and... Well played, guys. <laughs> the fucking recruit. Seriously. Yeah, uh, the recruit rushers got to be... Got to be a a pre-made team. There's no other way. I mean, that was far too synchronized to just be a spur of them. Oh, they're, they're, they're gonna do it again! Of course they're gonna do it again! Recruit, shotgun, and montane rush! We need to locate a bomb. This just turned into the zoo. And I'm loving it. I mean, if there was any way they could have done to basically make this game fun again, and I'm not, not meaning this 
Rupert this... is the best operator. He has every single gun. He's that is what I'm trying to tell every... Ubisoft in the Golden Ticket competition. But no, they don't, they don't want to send me to Montreal. They send someone else. I mean, I submitted a recruit that could be used by both sides. I mean, that would be OP as fuck. Come and think of it, when I described my submission, Raven, who was a little bit more than a recruit that could be used by both sides, as a recruit that can be used. Except the DLC ones. They don't deserve him. Praise the Lord. I mean, I'm, I'm I'm fairly certain these these are just a bunch of either trolls or Smurfs going on here. Yeah, so I'm attacking along just in case they have a one of those. This is ridiculous, and I'm loving it. Oh crap. Ella. It is kind of crap that I was the one getting hit, but... At the same time, I was the one being exposed, so... They actually got Ella, too. This... 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 What the fuck is going on, guys? And the funny f funniest thing is that... Oh. And now they basically just decided to go outside again. To, probably to just back up Montagna. No, because Montagna decided to go out again. <sighs> this is ridiculous. <laughs> Seriously! What the hell am I watching here? Ah, crap. They don't have that much time, but... Hate to be that guy, but one of you needs to go for the diffuser. The diffuser has been recovered. 15 seconds left. Down to one friendly. Oh, God. Five seconds remaining. We have been eliminated. Seriously, that was a nice try. I can't say anything other about it. Yeah. I, like I said, I can't say anything about it, because even if he had planted it, considering he had a shotgun, he could just as well have just gone from, from behind. Uh, I mean, I am tempted just to pick a recruit myself, but I think I won't actually do that. Instead, I will do something even worse. I'm gonna pick Rook. Nah, I don't think the golden ticket was political. I happen to know Candy and... Or rather, I know of Candy. And uh, I don't think that was political at all. I mean, she submitted 14 pages of that art. And that art was good. And people judge her over those four pages that Ubisoft decided to publish. So, sorry, you're not gonna get me to agree on that. I actually think Candy deserved to win, because the actual art involved was good. If you want to argue anything, it is, should it be a art contest? But, like I said, since we haven't actually seen all the pages, I feel it's unfair to judge the submission based on that. And in any case, 
her submission was better seconds. than mine. Mine was one page and then some text. Five seconds and counting. I know it's not a popular opinion, but it is how I see it at any rate. Uh, did I put down the armor? I got so distracted talking there for a moment. Yeah, I did put down the armor. Nice. So we are gonna stay here and we are. Entry team. Additional operators have just arrived. Welcome, new operators. So I think we're gonna have. Ah, crap. I'm hit. This direction. Ash. I didn't actually get the drone this time. Which is very annoying. But Ella got... So, we got the drone now. Nice. Basically, I'm just providing covering fire here. Yeah, our recruits are actually turning this. I am slightly amazed. Sledge is down, sledge is down. Okay, so the last guy is at B, and... B! Where is the guy? Here he comes. Tango down! Ash! So, last game. We went the distance here. Really went the distance. In terms of actual operator design, I would say that, yeah, I've seen operators I would like to play more. But in terms of artwork, I think it's, I still think it's solid. So there you have it. Uh, I'm actually going to pick Fuse this time around. Uh, let's see here. I don't even have a sh prayer for best player. So picking anything that's not Fuse. Seriously, if if I get a chance to play another round with these guys, then I'm gonna do that action. They are in Fuse Town, or rather, a place where Fuse actually does rather well. So we're gonna try and keep the drone alive and. Hello. Ten seconds. Five seconds to insertion. The diffuser has been recovered. You've located a bomb. Make your way to its location. I shouldn't be trolling them, but come on. How can I not? Then again, what I'm saying is technically correct, because we aren't four recruits. We're just three recruits who are carrying us. And did I just say three recruits are carrying us? I mean, that is a rather silly thing to say. Fuse charge coming right up. No, we're not gonna do that actually. Oh crap. Dude, I'm so sorry. Don't worry about it. I'm actually going to see if I can't. Rip I'm gonna repel down here and I'm gonna follow Fermite's example. And I'm gonna see about getting some charges onto that. W those windows. Because that is what we are gonna want to do at this stage in the game.
I basically just shot off the armor. Nothing else. Fuck. One minute and we still have a diffuser to find. Allies on my side. Ah, crap. I don't think we're gonna make this. Nah, they played well. I mean, it was one of the most ridiculous games I've ever played, and that alone is actually worth the loss, because I, 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 I can't say anything bad about this game. It was hilarious as fuck, and that was... That was well worth the actual defeat. But seriously, these this gang playing actual recruits and turning the game around with said free recruits. Yeah, let me guess. We got demoted again, didn't we? Let's see. Keep playing as a team. I'm gonna see if... These guys are going to stick around. They're not going to stick around too bad, really. But let's just jump into another another match. Now we stand truly on the brink of the abyss. And with that, I mean on the brink of bronze. I mean, my ego isn't really bruised until I'm in bronze. And considering I had a number of games where I was pretty much demoted from Gold 4 to Bronze 1, you can imagine I'm feeling a bit salty about the entire thing. Okay, so we got what looks like to be a bunch of Russians and what looks like to be... I have no idea. So we're gonna go with the traditional picks, Rook and Fermite. So where the hell are we gonna be? Arsenal room. Oh, it's secure area. Nice. And I had a group I was playing with semi-regularly. I think one of them is actually in chat. Hibana Banana. Uh, I don't know if he's still actually in chat, but hey. It all, all comes down to stuff. And... Um, he only plays Bomb, so recently I feel a lot more comfortable with Bomb, because it is with his team that I've been grinding Bomb. And the funny thing is, if I group with him, I play around the level I'm used to, that means meaning high silver, low gold. But I still get punished uh, for it. It's not like, oh, the, here's a bronze player in in this league we should go easy on him no i get i get punished for it i'm barricading the general idea is that it's usually not worth reinforcing the tunnel in case the enemy decides they really want to push it but the thing is if you don't reinforce the tunnel pretty much everyone can get in here what it's not use what is not useful in doing is putting a mute or a bandit there because they can be taken out far too easily by twitch drone or thatcher or pretty much anything okay so doc is there and i could just stand here you know but when it comes to this particular place a bit too much of the fight has turned into being a fight for the kitchen. And sometimes I camp in the garage. And camping in the garage is actually quite fun to do. Uh, it's quite interesting that we don't have any reinforcements here though. But it all comes down to, does the enemy oh fuck the fusing? This is starting off very well, you guys. I mean, we are getting completely trashed here in the first round. 
With one friendly operator standing, and he got killed by a knife. We got utterly trashed. I mean, it was a long time since I got that trashed in a Rainbow Six game. I mean, most of the... Holy crap, I'm not even going to... <laughs> Seriously? How the... How the hell did we get that trashed? Because that was an utter defeat on our part. I mean, I don't think even I don't think we got any one of this. We didn't get any one of them. Let's see if we can do better on the assault. You need to the then again, the we didn't even communicate a single word. I'm guilty of that too, so don't don't think I'm just blaming the team. Uh, but with 60 points, I can't really blame the team, can I? Uh, they're gonna be in the same spot, so that means we might actually try and push tunnel. I see a fat French guy in kitchen. Well, that could have been better. Five seconds to insertion. Uh, let's. The problem now is that since, since Doc is there, I do not know if he's gonna try and defend the tunnel by sniping from a kitchen. It is entirely possible that is exact. Oh, they actually got Doc. I'm gonna push tunnel. I wonder if they actually even... No, they didn't. That's interesting. Tunnel is completely undefended. Uh, that means I should drone it. I mean, I haven't gotten this far in Rainbow Six Siege without being suspicious when things are too easy. I really miss my breaching charges because I think I saw something. Now, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna report to the kitchen. And we're gonna blow this. Here we go. Let's see if we can't get some. The biohazard condition. Fuck, we are getting creamed again. We got one of them at least, but they, they are shooting the shit out of me. I can't survive another hit. That means Jackal and I need to do this. Down to one friendly. Yeah, I got, what, three fucking HP left. So what I'm gonna do is hope that they try to push the kitchen and instead try and push the tunnel. Just keep tagging them, guys. You keep tagging them, I might win this. Securing the container once the threat is neutralized. Ah, crap. I was out of ammo, and I thought I could go for the melee. I couldn't. <sighs> I deserved what I got, basically. At least I was dishing out this time, so... Let's see here. We could pick the Lord as a troll pick, of course, but... Uh, not Castle. Maybe Mira. Mira's a decent... Oh. Of course, someone that. 
on our team had to leave because, you know, why the fuck not? Let's go Mira and hope we can do better. Because right now we are doing absolutely horrid. The uh, we picked Garage for some ungodly reason, but hey, we can probably do this, hopefully. I mean, I would be satisfied if it was a 4-1 rather than a 4-0, because a 4-0 just feels so fucking hopeless. Go for it. Oh crap, we do not have a full barricade on on the top. And, you know, it's always a good thing when people decide that they're just gonna run out. Run away from the objective room. The objective room that's basically... Oh, thank you. Basically, just have one single place where they can actually hold. Oh crap, we're gonna die, aren't we? Thank you, Ella. That was really nice of you to help out. Nitro. Oh, our nitro is gone. Basically, all we have to do now is delay them. Ah, crap. But I'm not actually sure we can manage that. And I'm out of C4, and I don't know if Bandit has C4. Also, I'm running low on ammo. I got about three mags left. Protect the biohazard container. Swapping mags! Yeah. Uh, he detonated it far too early. Uh, the problem with the smoke is that I think that they have a glass. He's below you. Ash is below you. Right below you. I understand if Bandit is far too busy to revive me at the moment. Thank you. Now we need to spread out. One oh, come on! There's no way that wasn't a kill shot on a uh, on Blitz. I mean, I emptied an entire magazine into Blitz. <sighs> you see, this is the kind of games that makes everything very, very frustrating. I'm just gonna go ying, and I am going... Yeah, I got a compensator, ACOG, everything, yeah. This is the kind of games that make Rainbow Six Siege frustrating. And that is absolutely atrocious. I mean, when I have games like this, it is... It's a wonder that I do not turn toxic. Because it would be so easy. It would be so easy for me to say, oh, fuck everyone and, f and their mothers and everything like that. You know what? Yeah. I do not usually vote for a surrender, but in this case, I'm actually gonna do that. 
Because in this case, I don't see the point in playing this third game, in the, this uh, fourth game. I do not see the point, but we're not going to get that vote. Because what I think is going to happen is that we are going to be defeated in a 4 0. And. And what happens right after that is that I'm going to be demoted to most likely bronze again after just getting out of there. I have three of these, so I might as well use all of them. Oh, and by the way, we don't have a Fermite, guys. And I should have picked Fermite, but I didn't because I felt like... I needed a you better breaching option. To its Mira got that one and they didn't even bother breaching most of this. Now since I'm a paranoid fuck, I am going to I am going down this way. And I just realized I'm doing this the long way. Fuck. You see, it's very difficult to play well when you're this distracted. Because right now I am horribly distracted by the fact that we are horribly losing. Down to one friendly. And one of the things I like to do right now is this. Just go away and sit in a corner of the map. I'm not going to give them the satisfaction of that I am going to attack. Because I'm not going to. It would be suicide of me to attack. Even though I'm well suited for it. Uh, if they want to risk their lives looking for me, fine. They can do that. But I'm not going to attack. I absolutely refuse. At this point in time. So, they are gonna have to run around. And I'm not gonna let them have the kill. Or rather, I'm not going to let them have it unless they can make... Unless they know exactly where I am. And they don't. That's a trap. He wants me to come out. I'm not going to. I don't know if he knows where I am or if he's just baiting me, but I'm not going to do that. Not going to take the bait. Let's see if we can't. Ah, he was too far away. I actually thought he was going to come. Throw the fireworks! We did not secure the biohazard container in time. Mission failed. There are people who most likely would say it was childish of me to do that, but I don't agree. I don't see why I should play on their terms. I ended that game on my terms. And if I'm gonna be sent down to copper, at least I'm gonna act like it. Uh, then again, copper is not actually in any... F oh, we did not actually get demoted by one single point! One point away! But that's it for tonight. I'm not going to continue playing. But it, it was nice. The first game was absolute mental and a lot of fun. And the second one was just frustrating. So in a way, this stream have shown that there are two ways a defeat can go. Either it's the fun part, where the game is balanced, where the teams, the teams aren't toxic... Where a mad strategy actually just works. And then we have the agonizing defeat. The ones that just are nothing but you getting steamrolled by a team you know you can't handle. Either because your own team is not good enough or not coordinated enough. I think I think we were good enough. But I also think we were facing a pre-made. I don't think we were facing a group of random players and second of all 
Uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I actually made my point there without realizing it. But thanks you for tuning in, especially you people in chat who has been horribly silent for the, uh, the past. And catch you guys later. Uh, it was fun.